the UNESCO UNRWA partnership has supported four generations of Palestine refugees to receive quality education even in times of crisis. Education is UNRWA's largest programme, providing free basic education to over half a million Palestine refugee students in Lebanon, Jordan, Syria, Gaza and the West Bank. Also, secondary education in Lebanon, as well as running eight technical and vocational training centres and two teacher training colleges. UNRWA employs close to 22,000 education staff. The relationship between UNRWA and UNESCO began over 65 years ago, when UNRWA was first established by the UN General Assembly. In 1950, UNRWA started out with 93 schools and around 35,000 students. And since the 1960s, girls have made up around half of UNRWA students. Education brings hope. Despite the enormous challenges that Palestine refugees face, often in their daily lives. In 2014, the Director General of UNESCO, Irina Bakova, and the Commissioner General of UNRWA, Filippo Grande, renewed the commitment of the two agencies to work together for quality education for Palestine refugees by signing an MOU. The long-standing support to the UNRWA education program by UNESCO was exemplified in the education reform this sought to bring about transformational change in the teaching and learning practices in the classroom. The reform has led to an enhanced UNRWA education system where we see higher levels of student achievement, increased teacher motivation and lower student dropout rates. For over 65 years, the UNESCO UNRWA partnership has ensured that generations of Palestine refugees have received quality education even in times of conflict and emergencies. For UNRWA, delivering education in emergencies means doing some things differently, doing more of other things, and doing things that have not been done before. Doing things differently, for example, means utilizing the UNRWA self-learning program, which includes UNRWA TV, self-learning printed materials, and UNRWA interactive learning website. Doing more of other things is really understanding that children need time to play and be children. UNRWA does this through psychosocial activities in schools, providing additional counsellors and increasing recreational activities for children. Doing things that had not been the focus before is about looking at safety and security in detail, providing trainings for students, teachers and parents on how to stay safe. The UNRWA Education in Emergencies approach seems to be working. In the 2016 MLA test, the monitor student learning achievement across the five UNRWA fields, students in Syria performed the highest of all, despite living through years of conflict. And perhaps even more encouragingly, the survey which looked into the perceptions of our students, our teachers and our school principals, found that they were very positive about the education that was being delivered in their field. حرج يعني ظروف يعني سيئه كثير وفا بدي اضل ادرس يعني حتى امن مستقبلي